Hi viewers, welcome to Hindu World School. Thank you for watching. So today's topic is, it's not topic, it's a collective reading. So I will pull three cards from that we will get the situation or energies, different energies or some situation which is related to three cards. Okay, based on that we clarify the cards. So based on clarification, the reading will go on. So you can watch the reading if you think that any one of the energy is matching with you or complete whole situation is matching with you. It will help you to how to deal with that situation or if at all any one energy is matching and other energies are not matching also, you can watch so that other energies you can relate how it is affecting your situations or your life. So let's pull three cards so that we can find the situation. I want three cards. One more. So here the zodiac signs are this four of wands Aries, the full card Aquarius and the tower is Aries. So when it comes to four of wands, this energy is like a very beautiful family kind of situation where people are very happy whether it is a marriage or some kind of family situation where they both living in the same house very happy. They are enjoying each other's company I can say or at least here you cannot say they are couple or partners lovers kind of thing any people who are staying in the same house whether they may be best friends siblings family members or anything because it is two of hands is some kind of twin flame union also okay so and we all know that twin flame it doesn't mean that only wife and husband <laughs> it can be it other also other relations also so here these people are very understanding about each other I can say or at least when they are living in this house home they are having mutual understanding they are okay their energies are okay matching with each other I can say so that is the situation here the family situation are where people are living together with happy with lot of happiness with lot of satisfaction okay and here the fool card, this person is very, as we know fool is immature in a good way or bad way based on the situation we can tell what they did, what we, what clarification they will get. So as of now the fool card is very immature, not responsible. In a, see this person don't hold lot of responsibility I can say or they won't keep lot of luggage with them. They know how to release the luggage, they won't keep luggage with them because they want to live freely without any responsibilities I can say. They want to explore the world. They want to see the world. They love to see the things in a new way or I can say they, they love to be in child spirit. They want to always in touch with their inner child or they mostly live with their inner child. Sometimes in a good way it is okay. When person knows their responsibility, still they want to be like a kid, it is a good thing. But if at all they really not understanding their responsibilities and they are simply keeping themselves always in the inner child mode is not good. So it just completely depends on the situation again. But this person is very innocent also I can say, one kind of innocence, one kind of purity, the genuinity, purity, innocence is there. But at the same time, there is a lack of responsibilities, lack of uh, goal. It is like having some kind of goals because that is also responsibility. So if you have goals, that is also become responsibilities. But this person don't want to keep any kind of luggage. They have only small luggage. I think that is also regarding them. 
it is nothing but keeping themselves happy seeing the new things meeting with new people having adventurous life kind of thing okay and the other third one is it is like a situation i can say because here we got four of wands it's a home home situation where two pe two people are very much happy with each other and one person is like a responsible how this person will match we will see after clarifications and discover is nothing but some change happened something one some some kind of shocking happened in their life i can say or uh, between these people something happened where the tower is nothing but two couples they are falling from this tower so here we got two couples this card can match so here people are living very very happily in that home here people are falling from that grace i can say or falling from the tower that is nothing but it is kind of divorce or kind of some shocking surprising separation where they did not expected it because they both did not plan that separation because we are seeing this card they are very much with mutual understanding and a mutual love there is no fights no conflicts because in between also we did not got any kind of flight fights and uh, conflicts misunderstanding kind of thing if at all it is in the reverse misunderstanding but it is nothing it is upright only so everything is fine in this couple's life but there is a fool entered i don't know how this fool related to that couple and this tower moment happened in their life so this tower is completely break down breaking some kind of stability but one thing this tower is some kind of breakdown but which which built in the false foundation that is the thing the, with the tower it is like the tower is crashing down but why it is crashing down is the stability whatever the ground is there their stability is not strong i can say are it built on some false promises fake it is like fake love false promises or lies some kind of betrayals it built on that kind of uh, foundation the foundation is not strong the complete foundation is with lies betrayals uh, it is like uh, some sneaky shit cheating like which is not appreciated in that either it is a relationship or business thing okay where people should have some kind of trust and honesty but this foundation built on something which is not healthy that is also one reason tower is nothing but falling down because today or tomorrow it should happen when the foundation is not strong obviously it will fall down that kind of energy okay so let's see we will first pull the clarification for each card then we will see whether the story is matching with each and every card or not okay so now let's get the clarification for four of wands three cards for four of wands no only three cards So here clarifies for this four of wands is two of cups, ace of pentacles, and uh, three of wands. So this couple are couples. Okay, they are not siblings. They are staying at home. They are couples, like wife and husband, or lovers. They are in the partnership. They are two of cups energy, which is very loving, caring, understanding. It is like a soul level connection, or at least soulmate kind of connection where they understand each other very very well and they gel with each other very well and it is like a kind of divine union kind of connection or at least they feel that their union is very divinely guided or divinely connected it is one it is like feeling each other for blessing to each other they feel that this this couple 
they felt like they are blessing to each other and it, it is from the universe they are in very much love with each other there is a passion there is love there is protection there is a lot of it is not kind of abundance but it is like understanding mutual understanding mutual caring or i can say they may be strength to each other that kind of energy they are in a very good union i can say at least in between them they have very much understanding that is also reason it came like a two of cups energy so this now ace of pentacles i think these people want to start something new in their life or i can say that they want something big kind of new beginnings kind of a professional way because pentacles is a professional things are in the life also personal life also they want something new they want to start something new in a business wise in a relationship wise they want some new beginnings in their life Ace of Pentacles is some kind of looking for some kind of new being. Why I said looking for some kind of new being? See, here someone is waiting. Three of Wands. Some person is one person is here waiting for their ships to come towards them. So now it is like there is a new beginning for four of Wands people, whoever in this relationship. there is a, some new beginnings happened they, it is related to professional matters or related to personal matters they have some new beginnings at least they thought that they can start something new in their life which is stable but not very stable kind of thing it is like starting basic starting kind of thing it is not pentacle king of pentacle stable kind of energy long term energy it, it can be long term but in future it will decide whether it will go to long term or not as of now they are very much happy with each other and uh, they feel like they are like a soulmates and uh, they have a lot of love towards each other because two of cups is there there is no pentacle kind of thing so there is pure love is there they are exchanging their cup that means they both are loving each other and as i said two people feel like they are strength to each other and they protect each other that kind of energy and they want some new beginning in their life which is ace of pentacles which is not a big new beginning but they are expecting something new in this connection which is, which should be with the purity i can say because here we are seeing all the mutual understanding there is no cheating kind of thing there is no lies there is no sneaky thing so even in the future also whatever they are starting together they want to have that purity that stability which is some kind of benefited to the, to each other in a long term but at least as of now they are starting in a basic so here three of wands is different energy because here two two cards are different energies and here three of wands is this person is waiting for something which they know that they are going to get it or i can say that they did lot of hard work for whatever they want so they are simply waiting for that result for that hard work i can say okay it is like after watching these cards there is some kind of new beginnings and this person this couple want this new beginning at the same time this person is waiting for something I, this person also waiting for something it is like a new beginning kind of thing the result is will give some new beginnings to them so these two people are three people are waiting for this new beginning now we will see where it will lead and how come uh, because if this ace of pentacles came in the between between this two two cards and this person patiently waiting for it this person is very career oriented i can say or very professional very ambitious 
very courageous, very passionate person. They did a lot of hard work or whatever they need to do in their life to achieve something. They did everything. Now they are waiting for their result. Or I can say their ships are coming towards them and they are patiently waiting for the ships to reach them. That kind of energy. Now let's pull the card for this full energy. We'll check. Clarifies for this full. I want three cards for the full. Only three. One more. So clarifies for the fool is King of Wands, King of Swords, Nine of Wands. So here I cannot say this one of is fool because these four energies are completely different. So here I can say that the unknown, something unknown is happening or adventurous thing is happening which is, which is in the air <laughs> or which is not revealed it is not revealed kind of thing it is in the air so we they don't know what is outcome they are going to get so in this situation especially in the full clarification there are three energies queen of wands king of swords nine of wands so here queen of Hearts is a mother energy motherly kind of nature who is very passionate very ambitious very courageous very self-confident person who is who love to take action or action oriented person who is very passionate towards their goals ambitions are towards taking care of people handling the situations around them that kind of energy they are very courageous person and they are good at handling family as well as business i can say it is like business and family so they can be business person as well as homemaker so here king of swords is energy is completely different like very logical very strict military kind of person or very it is not in a bad way but some kind of controlling which they want everything should be under their control in a good way it is not like taking people advantage and keeping in the control it is simply whatever they are dealing whatever they are doing they want everything should be under their control so that they can see the whole picture what is happening how it is happening is that complete process is going in the right way or not the reason is king of swords is like a leader so when they are leading people it is very important for them to understand the things in a complete way, full picture it is not that simply seeing one thing and they can lead the people so that is also one reason this king of swords want everything under their control so that they can have the view of everything in into the situation whatever is happening is everything is going correctly or not that kind of energy so the process should be under their control because they are a king of swords energy it is like a leader who lead people or i can say some people working for them or who obey their orders if they are leading any kind of team people in the team they obey their orders so it is very important for them to check everything under have, having everything under their control and this person is very logical person they don't know what is emotions i think here we did not got any kind of emotional cards okay so they don't know what is emotions and all maybe they know also at least when it comes when they are dealing with people instead of using their emotional brain they mostly use their logical brain they deal with the situation and people with logic they are very good communicator i can say or they have the power to control the people just with their voice their communication they don't need anything to control the people that voice is enough or their communication is enough to get control over the people no matter how big the team is 
So here the nine of wands is completely different energy. This person is like a warrior. They did lot of hard work or they had lot of battles in their life. Finally, they reach it to nine of wands energy, and this person have lot of boundaries. They set lot of boundaries to themselves. Where because maybe in the past people took lot of advantage of them. That is also one reason this person is like a war became like a warrior. If someone want to try to cross their border boundary, they are ready to fight. That kind of energy because they don't want to give up. If someone trying to enter their boundaries without taking their permission or without uh, their consent, then they are going to fight with this person. It is like a fighting spirit card. They are very good at fighting. That is what battles warrior. They are ready for the battle. Next to battle here, they 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 already had nine battles in their life and now they are ready for the next battle. Whatever comes, they are ready to face it. That kind of energy, very warrior spirit kind of energy, fighting spirit kind of energy. Here, yes. in this energy, mostly the fire is there, air is there because the fool is also in the air. They don't know anything. Everything is in the air. So here, these three people also like it. It is not like a fool card when it comes to these three people because everyone is very mature. This king is king energy, king energy. That means very mature people. They know what are doing. They know their responsibilities. They know their uh, duties, kind of thing. And this person is a leader. They lead people, so we can not say that they are a fool. Okay. And this nine of swords, they have lot of uh, nine of wands is has lot of battles, so they cannot be fooled. That is also one reason they are very much guarded. Fool is not guarded. They are very much free. So here I think there is some situation in between these people. That is also one reason why we got this clarification for the fool. But whatever it is, it is in the air. Even they don't know what is going to come. The unknown situation is unknown. They don't know what is what will be the outcome. That kind of situation. Okay. So let's pull the cards for this uh, tower. Three clarifications for the tower. Clarifies for the tower is wheel of fortune, five of cups, the lover, the lovers. So I think here we know that tower is something happened suddenly, okay? Which is which is like a surprising kind of thing, shocking kind of thing. Here two couple are falling from the tower. I think this person, five of cups person, gone through some kind of. Divorce. Let's keep it this way. So here the tower is. I think this person gone through some kind of separation or divorce kind of thing because this person is. Crying over something. This five of cups is nothing but crying over something which is already lost or which has happened, uh, which is which they lost near to their heart. I can say, or there is some kind of missed opportunity kind of thing. They are crying over their past. It may be past. Thing. The tower is. They had some kind of tower moment in their life, which shake their ground. Or they got separated from their loved one, whether they are wife or lovers, someone. Because here two of cups is there, but still this person have in their life this lovers cup. But instead of watching this love opportunities, the lovers is one kind of choice also. Because I said tower is nothing but falling something which is not built on the. Right foundation. It is false foundation, which built on the false foundation. So it crashed down. But this person, of course, when something 
we lost something which is common that we are going to cry about that. But this person have a lot of opportunities I can say as at least someone who love them. The lover's card is nothing but having so many opportunities in love life or relationship matters. So this person instead of watching that options or choices in the love, they are simply crying over sweetly which is already over, which is nothing but discovered, which is already happened. Maybe they are reminiscing about this uh, relationship, whatever they shared with that person, other person. They are simply remembering all those memories. They know that, even they know that that is not good for them, but still they are unable to come out of that energy. And even though they have a lot of choices in their life, even though they are a very fortunate person, because we love fortune is nothing but having some kind of fortune. And this is also one reason why this tower came into this person's life. Maybe here something something wrong is happening to this person. In this tower, maybe it is looking like a very beautiful, but something wrong is happening. Or I can say that some injustice is happening to this person. That is also one reason it was thought that let's give some justice to this person and they crash this tower but as a human being instead of looking for the choices they are in, in here i can say maybe this person have some kind of letting go of the past they may be dealing with some kind of issues like abandonment issues or they are simply crying over past issues they may be having some issues they need to come out of it until unless they won't come they do, won't understand that there are still people in their life who is loving them who is ready to take care of them because the lovers is either they have twin flame in their life or they have um, other choices in their love it doesn't mean that this is the only thing exists maybe they have a lot of attachment with that person whomever they share that is also one reason they are instead of looking at these cups, they are simply crying over these things. In the spirit of things. So this person is very fortunate person. Even though they had a tower moment, it is a good tower moment for them. In, in, initially it may not looking like that because whoever they shared this energy, they are having a lot of attachment to this past. This tower is past. They had a lot of attachment to that past. That is also one reason instead of seeing the present moment, they are still living in the past. And because of that, they are unable to see the present happiness in their life. The love, the choices in relationships and the how fortunate they are. Because something injustice is happening here, finally now it is removed. They are out of this danger I can say. That is also one reason they became very fortunate now. Let's pull the outcome for this four of wands. I don't want to get completely deep into the situation because last time when I did, finally in the last moment I got it is still flame. So I thought better to pull the card first by telling explaining in the simple way. Then we will get into the thing after completing the pull, pulling the cards. So that it will give complete picture. So let's give the clarification for four of hands what is going to happen because here people are waiting for the new beginnings. So give me three clarifications. Sorry, not clarification. Give me three cards for outcome for this four of hands. Outcome for this four of hands. Two more. One For this four of fancy, 
king of hands the magician and the six of swords so here the king of hands energy person is i think here one of the person who is involved in the two of cups energy who are couple but now this king of hands is separated from this couple or because here i'm not seeing any other energy because we got two cards two couples who are dreaming of this four of hands energy i can say who feel like they are soulmates divine union or divinely guided connection they want some kind of new beginning in their life and they are waiting for it i can say at least one person is waiting for it three of hands is some kind of waiting so here this king of hands is feeling this person is very courageous very confident very passionate and very mature person they know how to use their passion how to use their their courage how to where to show their confident kind of thing or they are very uh, good at taking care of any kind of uh, battles i can say it is not uh, it is like battles means completing some kind of task showing lot of courage and passion towards completing something or taking action in a mature way and not just taking action completing successfully that kind of a very mature person i think in this two of cups energy there is someone who is very mature one person is very mature very passionate very confident very courageous person who know how to take action and when to take action how to use their passion in the at the right time i can say and here i think one person is a magician they are in a good way because this person is not in the reverse that means there is no manipulation it is simply they know how to manifest the things i can say so this person know how to manifest the things in a in a right way manifestation is a good thing so this person have the abilities they have all the four elements so they are still manifesting i can say because they want this four of wands energy with this because they feel that whatever they share this two of cups energy should become something into this union they maybe it is like getting married to this person whomever they think that two of cups energy they are their soulmate or uh, divinely guided union they they are from the universe gifted from the universe so they want this four of wands energy is nothing but one kind of marriage that is also one reason they want to stay in the same house it is like a becoming a family wife and husband couples spouse partners kind of thing so this person further they are manifesting whatever needed to done for this ace of pentacles to happen they are manifesting it and one person is here not taking any kind of action as of now this person is very mature they know how to take action how to be confident how to be courageous but still as of now they are not taking any kind of action they may be having some kind of regrets or they something happened we cannot see completely deep situation to situation we will see after all the complete clarifications and the outcomes we will see how it is related to it. so here one person one of the person from this uh, two of cups energy they are manifesting this union and one person is simply in the regrets or uh, they are not taking any action i can say even though they are in the position to take action they are not taking any action and here one person is waiting for it i think the same person who is manifesting it because they are waiting for the something so in that waiting they are not simply sitting they are manifesting it even though whatever need to be done in the 3d level they did everything now they are manifesting it and they don't want to it is like six of wands is one kind of stressfulness so they don't want to feel any kind of stress because it is a waiting period they are waiting maybe they are waiting for it from very long time but still their ships are not getting that this ships are nothing but based on this card this union this wedding should happen or they want union with this person whomever they think that two of cups energy and that two of cups is nothing but this king of wands is involved in that and this person want that relationship with this king of wands they want to stay together they want to get married because they want to have some new beginnings in this relationship but this person 
when they are waiting they don't want to get any kind of disturbances stress stress kind of thing because waiting will create some kind of stress so for that they are simply moving towards the calmer waters because in this situation they cannot do anything because there is no third person or involved i can say here they are completely two people are involved there is no third energy i am sensing and whatever needed to be done here one person is putting lot of efforts that i can sense whatever they want one person is even though they have all the capabilities to take action get this thing done they are not doing anything they are simply sitting and waiting or regretting they are not taking any action but one person is completely whatever they need to be done they need to do they did it they are simply waiting for the result and in that they don't want to get any kind of conflicts mind because the magician is nothing but manifesting something so this person may be a very good manifester they know when they are manifesting something there should not be any kind of stressful things they should not get any kind of negative stressful things that is also one reason they are moving towards the calmer water so that they can manifest this new beginning to happen in with this in between this couple okay so this is the first pile whoever match this energy it will, it can be matched to you not pile i can say that a first energy whoever in the four of wands energy who want marriage kind of thing some kind of stability expecting who is dealing with two of cups energy so let's pull the out, outcome for this fool card give me three cards for the fool outcome for the fool one so here the outcome for the fool is two of swords seven of pentacles and the high priestess i think here two of queen of wands is not in a position to decide what they want maybe they are having two choices or two roads or they are in the crossroads they need to listen to the intuition so so that they can take the decision but as of now they are not taking any kind of decision whoever this queen of wands energy they may be having lot of choices in their life at least two choices maybe this two people because we got three so this person unable to decide what is right what is wrong who is right who is wrong which path to take which path to leave that kind of energy but this person as of now they don't want to take any kind of they don't want to make any kind of decision because maybe there is some things should be come into the light because it is a blind fool card where they it is completely blank i can say or they are listening to the intuition two of wands even though this two of swords energy they are blind folded they are not able to see anything that is also one reason this fool card came everything is in the a not in the physical sense but they are listening to the intuition and that is also one reason they don't want to take any kind of action at least as of now when this reading is going on okay at least for some time also i can say but they are still just concentrating are just listening to their intuition or in in one way i can say that as per this energy queen of wands energy they don't want to trust anyone they just want to trust the intuition that is also one reason they close their eyes because when if they open their eyes there are so many distractions they don't want to get distracted they just want to trust their intuition so based on that they can make the choice because they are in the crossroads and this king of swords it is a very good energy it is like a leader kind of energy but this person invested their energy in the wrong place i can say they did wrong investments wherever they need to in, they invested it is not fruitful i can say that or they did not seeing any kind of result where they are getting into negative thoughts or they simply lost their hard work or time efforts whatever they invested 
because seven of pentacles is in the reverse they completely disappointed they completely invested somewhere which is wasted their investment their whether it is it can be time energy or money whatever they invested everything got wasted because wrong investments because of wrong investments because this person is a very king of swords is a very mature person leader kind of person but when they are doing some investments they miss you not misuse they use this energy in the wrong place i can say that is also one kind of investment using your energy now they are seeing disappointment or bad luck kind of thing where because whatever how much they may be trying they are not getting successful so they finally gave up on that and they are feeling bad luck negative disappointed because that investment itself is a wrong investment if it is in the upright it is happening but it is slowly happening this person is still feeling disappointed but it will, it is going to get success but it is in the reverse that means no matter how much effort they are going to put it's not going to work out whatever situation they are investing energy it is not going to work out they are simply wasting their energy wasting their time that kind of energy and here nine of wands energy is i am high priestess i think this person we said they are protecting something they are very much guarded towards something they have a lot of secrets and they are guarding their secrets and now we can ask say what kind of secrets it is so here this king of wands is dealing with two people based on this outcome and this king of wands is investing somewhere which is not fruitful for, for them at least it is waste investment i can say wherever they are investing their time energy or whatever they are doing working on it is not going to get any result or successful it is completely a failure project they are working on and here the nine of wands is they are simply protecting themselves because they don't want some secret should come out there are lot of secrets in their life they don't want that secret to come out or people to know about it that is also one reason why this person is guarding themselves very high that they are not entertaining anyone in their boundaries because once they enter they allow anyone to come into their boundaries they will know the secrets of this person this person is very secretive they are warrior kind of person but they are very secretive they don't want anyone to know their secrets i can say that is also one reason they are very much guarded towards others they are not letting people to come into their life easily so let's pull the outcome for this tower card three card for the tower outcome so outcome for the tower is the moon page of swords and the chariot so here the thing is this person who ever crying five of cups energy because of this tower moment they have lack of information or they don't know complete truth about the situation whatever situation have they dealt with which happened which crash because of this tower moment maybe it fit all it is a relationship matter or if it all is a relationship matter they are very much into that relationship but this person don't know complete truth about that relationship i can say or at least whatever situation they are dealing they don't have complete truth. they don't have complete information because again we got the moon card that is nothing but lot of secrets lot of insecurities lot of fears lot of anxiety and this page of swords also one kind of fearful it is like kid energy immature energy where they are not having complete information or they don't want to know about 
complete truth even though they have a chance to get into the deep this person unable to do it because because of this unknownness i can say or because of that fear insecurities because they sars is nothing but cutting everything even though if it is a secretive also they can easily cut that but this person is immature person page of swords is not that courageous person like a king of swords energy so they even though they had a chance to find out the truths about the situation they did not done it because of that fear insecurities because this person is very much attached and when they know that something wrong is happening they got information it is not that complete zero information they got some information page of swords is having information but not complete information lack of information that when we get to know something about someone or some situation what we do as maturely we try to find out complete truth complete facts about that situation but this person don't want actually they don't have courage to do that because if at all it comes true if at all they came to know about that someone is a not un, not trustworthy or someone is not honest they don't have courage to deal with that thing face the truth i can say whatever truth they are going to reveal they are unable to handle it that is also one reason even though they had i i think now also even though they have chance to find out about the truth they are unable to do it because of that fear because of that anxiety i think in this tower there is so much there are so many secrets there are so many things which this page of swords don't know this person can find out if they want they need to show that courage they need to show the courage they need to show that strength to find out the things but they are not doing because they are fearful because moon card is a dark card they are not having that much maturity i can say or because of their own mental fears own anxieties or own some kind of illusions they are unable to take the risk that is also one reason universe give this tower moment because tower moment won't happen naturally if the person they know something but still they want to continue with this because of not having strength to come out of it then tower moment will happen universe don't let it happen for long time so here this person had a chance to find out the thing but they lack of that courage they want to continue in the same situation even though it is not good for them because there are so many secrets and all because of this fear and anxiety they are unable to decode the things i can say what is happening exactly in this situation that is also one reason it got tower they got tower moment even though they like it or not they are matured or immature they have courage to deal with it or not in was don't thought anything they simply give that tower moment because it is not good to continue more for long time i can say and this lovers card i think finally this person is coming out of this not exactly now i can not say because they need to have some more courage because in this situation they have the simply because they have lot of anxieties lot of fears unknown fears that is also moon card is like complete hidden things so they have lot of unknown fears where they are unable to find the complete information or they unable to research dig deep into the situation to find what exactly is happening so at least after some time they are going to come out of it and they will travel towards their soulmate i can say are this choices whatever they have choices in their life 
because they are very much fortunate person this person is very fortunate person actually because of their because of their anxiety fears unknown fears or lack of information moreover they don't have a lot of courage they are like a page when they are when it comes to take some risk they are not courageous because of that they are unable to see how fortunate they are they need to mature i can say here for that they need to deal with this moon energy that is nothing but they need to deal with their own fears own anxieties own illusions whatever whatever fears stopping them to move forward in their life because the chariot card is nothing but moving forward in their life finding their person balancing themselves and finding their person and lovers is nothing but having so many choices this person is very fortunate but they are simply sitting in the past not letting go of this past they are simply crying over about this situation whatever situation happened which is not good for them but they don't have complete information about the situation they can find out all the information but they lack that courage they lack that maturity and they have so many fears everything is stopping them to reach this fortune or find their person who is destined for them i can say or who is kind of soulmate energy so finally i think this person is going to come out of all those things because final card is like a chariot they will find out this courage they will work on themselves they will find out and they will they will be in the they will be in a journey towards their soulmate they will come into that path where they can find that they the person who is meant for them so further they need to do lot of inner work i can say here it is very much needed for this person so now let's see at least where three energies are different whether this three energies are matching somewhere or not in this situation whether this this people are related to each other or not or simply they are different energies so i think whoever dealing with this two of cups energy as of now you are in a relationship or you already dealt with them because it is you always take as a past and now maybe you are regretting or you people are not together someone is waiting to come this union or to have some kind of new beginning in this relationship and at least they are expecting marriage in this some kind of long term commitment kind of thing long term stability because two of cups is a love, lovers it is like two couples who are loving each other but they are some one maybe both are expecting this kind of four of pentacles energy but something happened the thing is here this person is not taking any action okay when they, even though they have a lot of courage confident everything where in a place where they can act, take action but they are not taking action they have their own reasons now we cannot pull more cards why they are not taking action and one person is continuously manifesting it they are manifesting some kind of new beginning which is nothing but stable relationship which is long term which is like a marriage kind of thing where people should be in the harmonious relationship now i cannot say this person is manifesting with this same person because here person is waiting for that person and they are moving to the calmer water so here i am not seeing that these two people are coming into union okay this person is manifesting but as of now they are manifesting something new beginning which is marriage but it doesn't mean they are manifesting that marriage with the same person they are simply want some kind of stability in their life stable relationship with honesty or with happiness lot of happiness and they are waiting for that stability i can say here 
the conclusion is two of cups whoever you are dealing so don't get triggered or don't get sad feel bad because whatever we think this universe will have some other plans for us okay so here two of cups whoever dealing in two of cups and who want to have this beautiful four of wands energy which is loving beautiful family even though they are manifesting i don't think you are going to get it especially one person is manifesting one person is simply sitting in a regrets in a some kind of regrets or whatever decisions they made in the past whatever actions they took in the past because of that they are not taking any action okay here i want to tell that maybe this person did something wrong because of that in this in this union two of cups energy or at least they it is not wrong kind of some wrong decisions maybe this person realized that this person is not meant for them initially they may be thought that this two of cups is like a divine reunion they will be together forever kind of thing but they got some clarity and they thought that this is not going to work out or they, they may be having some other different issues that is also one reason even though they are in a place to take action they are not taking action and one person is completely manifesting something in their life and that is nothing but some new beginning which can give them this stability this happiness that happy family kind of energy and they are waited for it maybe now also they are manifesting and they are waiting for it finally they are moving on if at all not they are going to move on now i cannot say this is you this is you whoever dealing with two of wands four of wands there are two people existed so one is going to move on one is not going to take any action okay one is completely moving on from the situation they are not hoping anything from this connection i can say okay because there is a connection existed here two of cups the connection is existed two people are dealing with each other but they are unable to take this union forward because someone is not ready to take any kind of action and one person is completely manifesting but we always say relationship only work when two people are putting same efforts only one person is putting efforts it's not going to work out here one, only one person is keep on putting their efforts they are doing all everything whatever they can because they are magician they want to manifest like this new beginning i here i am not sensing that this person is completely manifesting that new beginning with the same person they want one stable relationship whether it is happened with this person it is okay if it is not happening with this person then also they are okay with it they want one person who can understand them who can stay with them for a long time who are very trustworthy honest who are in their level i can say okay that kind of energy so i think that is also one reason this person is ready to move on from the situation as of now currently when you are watching if at all you are the magician you are still manifesting these things you are finally going to move on from this two of cups energy you are not going to stay with this two of cups energy if at all your manifestation is not working that is also one reason because you are still confusion state of mind or you are still it is like not confusion i can say like a stress kind of thing because six of swords is one kind of stress stressful atmosphere because of that stressful atmosphere also you are unable to manifest if at all you are magician or whoever magician because of some kind of stress when we are dealing with stress anxieties fears our manifestations won't come into the reality it won't it will won't come into fruition we need to be calm we need to be patient that kind this person has lot of patience because three of hands is some kind of patience they are manifesting they are ready to wait for the result but they have some kind of stress maybe because of this two of cups energy they still have that stress they need to move on from this situation so finally they are moving on in the end the six of swords energy came so they are completely moving on from this energy they are going to manifest whatever they are looking for this four of wands kind of energy and here as we said it is a full card that is nothing but unknown three people are dealing with unknown they don't know what is going to happen because this three cards also again outcome also mystery kind of things for three people it is not that only for one person one person is completely having choices they don't know what to choose so they simply 
listening to their intuition so they finally they will listen to intuition and they will decide but we don't know what outcome they are going to get based on their intuition only that is also one reason i am telling it is like mister this outcome is completely mister in this situation and one person is completely invested somewhere no matter how long they are going to work how long how much time they are going to put give for that thing whatever they are working that king of swords they are not going to get successful it is finally in the end also it is a failure project if at all this person is working any kind of relationship matter which is not working and but still they want to do it if still they want to do it that relationship will be failure in the end if they are working on some team because why i am telling you is seven of pentacles is like they are moving towards 10 of pentacles energy which is nothing but one stable grounded energy whether it is related to business project whether it is related to strong stability in the family okay so here this king of swords if at all they are investing their energy with team of people because they are in the position of leader where they can lead the people finally they are going to fail in that project because this person is not investing in the right people i can say if at all relationship it is not in the right people if at all it is a business project they are not investing in the right business projects right projects they are simply wasting their energy they need to get uh, they need to understand because they have power they have lot of power they have lot of uh, energy uh, they have that leadership skills but they lack that clarity it is not about clarity it is about to see the things which is going to work out which is not that kind of energy they need more analyzation i can say are you they need more it is one kind of card seven of pentacles is sometimes this person can know that this is not going to happen or this project is not good this part project is not going to get any kind of benefits for them returns for them but still they will put that efforts that is also the seven of pentacles energy is that even though they know that they are not going to get any return still they put their efforts so that kind of they need to get that balance if this king of swords need that balance even though they are a leader it doesn't mean that it is it is a good thing they have a very good capability that they can lead the people but in the right direction they need that balance which is good which is bad where need to put that efforts where they need to wait where they need to take action that kind of energy maybe they need some kind of direction i, I can see here king of swords will be having direction they are not like a knight of swords but still this person need to understand some things maybe that is also one reason we came, this came into this king of swords energy came into this pool under the pool energy that means they don't know about some things they need to understand some more things or they need to learn maybe this kind this situation is one kind of lesson for them so where to invest where they should not invest whom to trust whom should not trust that kind of energy maybe they are dealing with a team because leadership is nothing but handling some kind of team and they are trusting their team is very good very trustworthy very honest they don't know the real truth that is also one reason the project whatever they are working it is going to get failed and here this nine of wands energy this person is completely it is like strong boundaries they set lot of boundaries around them where they are not entertaining anyone in their life because they had lot of battles in their life for people who ever come into their life everyone took advantage of them that is also one reason they don't want to allow it, entertain anyone in their life so that people cannot take advantage of them this person also need to learn that is also one reason this full full card came they need to it is see when you are in we are in nine of wands energy it is very difficult to trust each and every people that is also one reason this person is very secretive they disclose they won't disclose anything to anyone that is they are i can say that they won't share anything to anyone they are completely secretive person whatever they have regarding them or their life they completely keep it as a big secret they don't want to reveal it because they may be having lot of 
things in their life or a lot of experiences dealing with the bad people untrustworthy people not honest people not loyal people so that kind of energy because this nine of wands is nothing but having already they had some battles with different experiences with different people but they need to learn way to set the boundaries we should not i can say but i think here this person is completely in the high priestess mode it is very difficult to get into their boundaries as i said if they try to get they are ready to fight it fight for it they know don't let people to come into their boundaries i can say they don't let and entertain anyone in their and based on this cards here someone is manifesting their some stability in their life and that person is nothing but the magician and here someone is completely guarded towards their boundaries towards themselves towards their life towards their completely personal life whatever it is they are like high priestess means secretive person and we know that this magician can handle this high priestess even though they are very guarded very much guarded very much like a warrior kind of person who is ready to fight still this magician can handle this high priestess because they can manipulate it is not not like a manipulation this person can gain this person's trust high priestess trust because this magician hold that power to gain the high priestess trust because they can the magician is nothing but one kind of manifester or it is like a magician who is white magic who do white magic nothing but this manifestation scripting and all they can read the people some kind of psychic abilities where they can read the people minds we can they can understand the inside of the people like getting deep into the people without touching them or without talking with them they can read the people they have that ability that is why we call magician and this high priest is very secret that is also one reason why this magician can understand this high priestess even though they are very much guarded very much like a warrior kind of person who don't entertain anyone still this person can understand this person this person can get it is like they can win their heart i can say magician can win their win this high priestess heart and moreover we all know that these two people are co-creators this high priestess and the magician both are co-creators and they will be having some purpose to create something on the planet so that is also one reason why they will they can handle it also because magician also not easy to handle by anyone people cannot handle the magician but high priestess can do that because high priestess is one kind of psychic ability card also they know they they are very silent they are very intuitive because their intuition is very high so with that their intuition with that third eye they can read anyone that is also one reason this magician if at all they are they are doing something in the back also this white magic not a black magic kind of thing but still this high priestess can understand them with their intuition so here magician is manifesting something in their life with that manifestation i can say they are meeting this high priestess they are going to get this high priestess in their life because they have some purpose they hold some purpose because they are co-creators they need to create something on the planet that is their purpose i think this king of wands have some kind of choice choices in their life or they have some is like choices or crossroads kind of thing they are going to find out because we are seeing that they are listening to their intuition so they will guide it towards their intuition and this king of swords need to be learn some lessons so i want to conclude the reading so 
So someone's manifestations are coming into reality, but not with the person whom they are thinking or who they want. It is coming with the different person. And I think here, tower moment caused this person to move towards their lover, or I can say they this tower moment caused this person to meet their twin flame. The lovers is nothing but a twin flame. But before that they need to deal with this. Actually the thing is, this is the reason why this tower moment happened, but because of this sorrow or sadness, this person is unable to see the things clearly, why it happened, because under the tower movement this person is crying because of this tower movement but they are unable to see the wheel of fortune and the lovers which is very blessed cards for that they need to deal with this immaturity or lack of information they de they need to deal with lot of anxiety fears whatever fears they may be dealing they may be holding and so that they can come into this energy where they can balance themselves and they can meet their twin flame or the distant partner. I hope at least two energies can match because one is magician, one is high priestess, definitely they they can match together. So take the messages if any any anyone may it is like it is one kind of situation, one situation where two people are dealing, finally they came out from the relationship. Because two of cups is a relationship, pure relationship. They came out from that situation or relationship. And one is tower happened, that is also I am sensing it is a kind of separation. Because there are so many secrets or so many, so many lies that, that built, the tower built on the false foundation. So definitely these two situations will match. And this cool energy, we are getting three energies, not single energy. So it is like an unknown thing for them, what is happening. Or I can say that they don't even know what is going to get in their future. So that is also one reason this nine of wands energy, who became high priestess kind of energy, they don't know that they are going to meet that magician, they hold that purpose in their life. So anyway, thank you for watching. For more readings, you can like and subscribe. For personal readings, you can mail me. You will find the details in the description box.